Hey Internet, I'm Color Flarty, and welcome to another blind let's play. This time it's a game that's gotten wildly popular over like the last year, maybe two years. Undertale! I've heard great things about this game. And alright. So I literally I don't know that much about this game, to be perfectly honest. I'm going in pretty much completely blind, which I've heard is a good way to go. Makes for a good let's play. I do know a couple things. I know there are a couple different endings to the game. I know you don't have to kill enemies, even though it's an RPG. And I know a couple of random memes about the game. Other than that, I don't really know anything about this. I also know it's got awesome music. So, basically, funny story, like... When Undertale came out, I'm like, I like, I kind of had heard about it. I'm like, oh yeah, all right, I'm like that's cool. That sounds cool. And okay, I've I've literally looked up nothing about Undertale at all, and yet for some reason, my Facebook was for the, like an entire year to like a year and a half, just completely filled with Undertale stuff, even though I've looked up nothing about the game. And I was just like, really, like this doesn't even look that good. And it kind of turned me off for a while. Until my brother got it, he's like, oh man, it's amazing, you'll love it, and a lot of people recommended it. So, decided to do this as a blind let's play, but before I begin, before I even push the play button, I thought it would be fun for me to kind of talk about like what I think the game is about, just based on what limited stuff I've seen on Facebook about it. So, here goes. my. This is what I think that the game is about. So, I'm picturing... I know you played as a young girl. I'm guessing like she like lives in just kind of like a normalish village, and then like like everyone in the village is like, oh like, but be warned, there are like monsters in this world, and they're evil, and like they'll kill you if you get her like get caught by them. And basically, she falls down a hole into the monster world, and then discovers, hey, the monsters aren't actually that bad after all. And she makes fun friends with a bunch of rabbit fiends, and she also becomes best friends with uh, two skeletons. One of them wears a hoodie, and the other one is obsessed with finding the recipe for the best spaghetti ever. And then, of course, she realizes that even though she loves the monsters, she has to go back to her house because her parents are now very worried about her and they're sending basically a rescue squad to rescue her and they're going to kill all the monsters. So they have to get her back to her area, like back to like her land. But along the way, they're meeting monsters that actually are trying to kill her. So that's what I think this is going to be about. So... Let's see how accurate I am. Let's play Undertale. Alright. Long ago, two races ruled over Earth. Humans and monsters. Move it, Steam Community tab. I don't care. I can't read. Thank you. One day, war broke out between the two races. It was that Ganon. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later... Mount Ebot, 2001X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Uh-oh, is she tripping in? Oh my gosh, am I actually correct about the first part of this? Am I actually correct about this? Thus far, it's looking pretty accurate. <laughs> Undertale. All right, this could be interesting. Press two or enter. I uh, okay. I want to configure for a joystick, please. Let's make that a. Okay, so it's not registering my controller. All right. Let's make this X. Then menu. Let's make that. Oh, okay. Dirt choice. I don't really know what that is. Okay, that looks good. 
This looks extremely simple. <laughs> oh, F4. Yes, please. Full screen! That's what I wanted. Okay. When HP is zero, you lose. Yeah, no, duh. Name the fallen human. Uh... I think her name is Frisk. But I'm not doing that. I'm gonna do my own name. Let's see, who does she remind me of? She looks like an Abby. Is this name correct? Yes! Abby! And she's yellow. Ooh, interesting. Hey, hey, what's going here? Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hi. Hmm, you're new to the underground, aren't you? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go! See that heart? That's your soul! The very culmination of your being. Oh, weird. We can move the heart around. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of levels. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. I'm so sorry. I thought it stood for level because it's, you know, an RPG. You want some love, don't you? Of course I do. I will never say no to love. Don't worry. I'll share some with you. Aww. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. What the? You idiot. <laughs> In this world, it's kill or be killed! <laughs> Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Oh my gosh! Die! Oh, what the heck? This is great! Oh, Dane. Oh, you! I've seen you a lot on my Facebook page. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Okay, I love this already. It's already hilarious and unexpected. Hey, I want that! The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. I mean, yeah, sure, I'll save. File saved. Hey, wait for me! Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Alright. Only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. Alright. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Press Z to read signs. Stay on the path. Yeah, th thanks for that. Push that one! Please press this switch, Toriel. Are you Toriel? I want to press this one so bad. Pre please press this switch too. No, I'm pushing this one. No, no, no! You want to press the other switch? I even labeled it for you. Yeah, I'm a rebel. <laughs> Splendid! I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Yeah, thanks, man. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. 
When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time, I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. This looks like a battle droid, kind of. Or like a sheep in a bonnet. You encountered the dummy. I'm beating the dummy up, forget this. BAM! Oh yeah! <laughs> ah, the dummies are not for fighting. They are for talking. We do not want to hurt anybody, do we? Come now. It's an RPG, I gotta beat stuff up. <coughs> There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Oh please. I've played Zelda 2, I can solve- Actually, Zelda 2 doesn't have a lot of puzzles. Um... I've played through Master Quest. Hey! Froggit attacks you. Alright, um, uh... Froggit, attack 4, defense 5. Life is difficult for this enemy. Oh, no. <laughs> you won, even though you literally did nothing. <laughs> The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Do I have to memorize this? I hope not. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Hey, everyone out of Abby's way! Don't even try to fight me. I beat a dummy to smithereens. I can beat up a frog. Or a hog, or a Dr. Seuss wannabe. I don't know why I said that. This certainly is a long corridor. Ooh, call him! Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there is an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will get you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? How many adventures began by the hero being good? Rain. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them by yourself. Be good, alright? Click. Hey, dude! Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight at you until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If the monster does not want to fight you, please, use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Sounds sound. Ooh, is this a robot that has candy? It says take one, take a piece of candy. Heck yeah. You took a piece of candy. Press C to open the menu. I'm taking more than one. I took more candy. How disgusting. <laughs> Can I take another one? You take another piece. You feel like the scum of the earth. <laughs> I love the sense of humor. Take one. Take a candy. Yes. You took too much too fast. The candy spills onto the floor. Oh no. Oh well. I should have some stuff. Oh yeah. I got monster candy. It was worth it. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination, so that's what the meme is from. HP fully restored. Oh yeah, look at her walk. She's so weird. She only moves one foot. Hey, it's Froggit! Hey, Froggit. You look fabulous today. Froggit didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply, Ribbit. Froggit seems reluctant to fight you. All right, let's mercy. Spare him. You won. You earned zero XP and two gold. Interesting. 
I didn't earn any EXP. That's a problem. I can't do this well. I can't do this as a level one. Oh, hi. Was that it? Rain. Hello, this is Tariel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer, cinnamon or butterscotch? Uh. That. Those are two completely different things! It's like. It depends. Like, if it's like, oh, I like cinnamon rolls more than I like butterscotch candy, but I'd rather eat butterscotch candy than cinnamon straight. Now well, we'll go with cinnamon. That's an apple pie. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Click. Green. Hello, Mrs. Tariel. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Click. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. Froggy, you again? All right, clearly you want to fight, so let's beat him up. Hop, hop. Look, Froggy, you put this on a pump. Oh wait, hang on. Frog it hops to and fro. You brought this on yourself. You won. Then the frog disintegrated. Heck yeah. Oh, this is gonna be great. I'm loving this already. Oh! Cracked floors! Ah! Please don't step on the leaves. Crunch, 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 crunch. I'm such a rebel. Oh, is this a frog again? It's Whimson. Hey, Whimson. What are you? Five attack, zero defense. This monster's too sensitive to fight. Oh, I have no choice. Oh, no, I can't beat up this, Fane. Wimsome continues to mutter apologies. I'll spare you. I won. I got nothing for doing that, though. That's... That feels empty. Didn't you read the sign downstairs? <laughs> I'm sorry. You gotta know, Colorful Artie's a rebel. Actually, Colorful Artie's really not a rebel, but Abby is. Whimsome. <laughs> if you weren't so meek, you, you're like, it's like the negative man from uh, Mother Free. Where it's like, you really don't want to beat it up. Ah, oh, the froggies again. Hey, froggy, hey. Don't you stink. Froggit didn't understand what you said, but was scared anyways. Rub it, shiver, shiver. This is so weird. Froggit seems reluctant to fight you. All right. Croak, croak. Hey, Froggit. That was the worst attack ever. Ow! You hit my heart with a fly! I'll kill you for that! Meow! Why is the frog saying meow? I know it's a weird game. Frog, it's trying to run away! I'll spare you. Let that be a lesson to not beat up on a little girl again. Whoa there, partner! Who said you could push me around? Huh? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin! I kind of wanted you to move a little more than that. Huh? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? <laughs> this game is ridiculous. Well, you know, only four out of five rocks wanted you to push them. Huh? That was the wrong direction? Okay, think I got it. There you go. Oh, you jerk! You move back on that switch, huh? You wanted me to stay there! You're giving me a real workout. Thank you for that. Now stay there forever.
This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Is it now? Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Okay then. This is such a weird game, but it is hilarious, so I love it. Oh, boo-hoo! I know what's gonna happen when I touch that ghost. Zzz. Are they gone yet? Zzz. This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force. Yeah! Here comes Nap Stab Look. Okay. No, I didn't want to beat it up just yet. I'm fine, thanks. Okay, this is seriously reminding me of Mother Free. Hey, Nips. Uh, let's, uh, check it out. 10 attack, 10 defense. This monster doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, I'm real funny. Really not feeling it up to it right now. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Stab look is wishing they weren't here. Well, I'll mercy you. Just plugging along. Okay. Don't you cry on me. Hey. Napstablick, I think you're looking fabulous today. I'd just weigh you down. Aww. This is literally the negative man from Mother Free. Hey. Move it or I'm gonna move you for you. You give Napstick look a cruel look. Oh, go ahead, do it. Hey, Napstab, look! I know you can do it. You gave Napstab, look, a patient smile. Heh. <laughs> I think that'll work. <laughs> Napstab, look, just looks a little bit better. Napstab, look, you are a valued member of society. You told Napstab, look, a little joke. Heh <laughs> That was cruel. It's like, I'm like, yeah, you're a valued member of society. It's like, that was a joke. Cheering seems to have improved nap stable. Okay, what is that? Nap stable looks mood again. All right. Hey, dude. I think you would like to go to this party I know of. Nap stable look wants to show you something. Let me try. I call it dapper bloke. I love it. I love it. That hat looks amazing on you. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get you out of your way. Thank you. Oh, that guy looks so depressed. Did you miss it? Spider bank sail down into the right. What? Come eat food made by spiders for spiders of spiders? I am so going there. Spider bake sale, all proceeds go to real spiders. Oh, sign me up for soccer practice, Deborah. Leave 18G in the web? I don't have 18G. Leave 7G in the web, yes I will. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. Oh, that's so nice of them. I love donuts. Ribbit, ribbit. <sighs> my friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they skip through my words by pressing X. That's right, pressing X. Oh, not you too. I'm pushing Z. Ribbit, ribbit, I heard using F4 can make you have a full screen. But what does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I have only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling, to say the least, ribbit. This game is so weird! <laughs> ribbit, ribbit, I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? Very helpful. It's bad. <laughs> it is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. Green. Hello! I just realized that it has been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of fiends lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but don't carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You'll want to leave room in your pockets for that. Click. 
Then give me more than eight inventory slots. There's just one switch. Boom, boom, out of Abby's way. Oh, I see the switch. And I don't mean the Nintendo Switch. Hey, Mike Wazowski drew near. All right, I'm beating you up because I can. Please don't pick on me. Oh, I'm sorry, Mike. Smells like eye drops. Hey, Luke's. I'm not gonna pick on you. Finally, someone gets it. Love the music. Luke's is staring right through you. Hey, I'm gonna check on you. Is it six attack? Don't pick on him. Family name, Eyewalker. Don't point that at me. Oh no! It's Moldorms! I hate Moldorms! Luke's is gazing at you. Hey, Luke's. I'm not going to pick on you. Finally, someone gets it. Stop throwing stuff at me. I'm not picking on you. I don't like this. Luke snatches its teeth. Finally, someone gets it. Okay, seriously, this is not working out. Hey, Luke's. You stick. You rude little snipe. You're the one who's attacking me when I'm deliberately not picking on you. You've earned yourself a big fat slap in the face. Quit staring at me. Hey, Luke's. Luke away! Don't point that at me. I don't really see any way to not kill him at this point. Slap! You won! And we gain free XP and five gold. Ahem. Now then. Ooh, well. There's a pineapple in the basement over here. I want to have a look. That is not a pineapple! That is a Vegetoid! And he came out of the earth just to see me. Check him. Vegetoid, 6 attack, 6 defense, serving size, 1 monster, not monitored by the USDA. That's not good. Part of a complete breakfast. Start your day in a healthy way, Vegetoid! Farmed locally, very locally. Ah! No onions, please. Hey, Vegetoid. Slap. Contains vitamin A. I don't know, that's not FDA regulated. He gives you a mysterious smile. I'll smile with a slap. Fresh morning taste. Vegetoid seems kind of bruised. <laughs> All right, I'll spare you. You won, and we earn nothing for that. What the heck? I'm not sparing people anymore. I need some EXP. It's Vegetoid. Prepare for a bruising. Contains vitamin A. This is very fun, though. Contains vitamin A. At least that move is... Uh, he seems kind of bruised. You're about to get even more bruised. If you won, we get CXP and my love increased. I beat up a vegetable and my love increased. That makes sense. It's a switch. Press it. Why not? Nothing happened. The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation in perspective. I just know that lady bunny thing is behind one of these. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. No, I need more HP. Stupid Vegetoid, will you leave me alone? Fresh morning taste. Don't you know I eat Vegetoids for breakfast? It's funny because Vegetoid is a fruit. Not more bouncing fruit? Oh no, this could be bad. I could very easily die here. Oh man. 
He seems kind of bruised. Fine, I'll spare you this once. Just stop beating me up. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. I am stuck. No, I'm not. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Not Vegetoid. Oh, not Luke's! I ate the spider donut and I recovered 12 HP. Sweet. Please don't pick on me. Well, guess what, Luke's? I don't know how to not pick on you. What an eyesore! This is not one night of Flumpty's 2. There's no eyesore in this. What an eyesore! I want to find another save point so I can save and quit. He's watering, I'll mercy you. I win. At least I got four gold from him. Oh, I bet the blue switch is back here. It's a switch, press it. Yes! You hear a clicking sound. Please be a save point. If you can read this, press the red switch. It's a switch, press it, yes! You hear a clicking sound, and see the spikes drop in front of you- NO! Not you again! Slap it, you face! Ding 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 ding! How about a staring contest? Books is watering, there you go. Don't play! All right, fine, I'll kill you. That's what you want, apparently. I'm not sparing any, but no. Goodbye, Luke's. Luke Skywalker, get it? If you can read this, press the green switch. That was not the green switch. Is there a run button? Okay, come on, don't- nope. I don't want to fight anyone. It's a switch, press it! Yes! You hear a clicking sound! It's a cross, I'm not stepping on those leaves. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there. I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. I was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er... Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Oh, you have a safe bo Yeah! Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. We're saving and we're quitting. Because, wow, this episode's gone on for a long time! Man, this is a fun game! I can't wait to start playing more of this! Thanks for watching! I'm Color Farty! I don't know what we're gonna do next, because it's a blind let's play! Have a great day, and God bless!